Hi friends, it's Sarah. I miss you guys and I hope that you're having a great, beautiful day. And today, I picked out a book called Mini Mechanics, Tractors and Trucks to Read. <clears throat> Mini Mechanics. Welcome to our workshop. Meet the crew. We've got some amazingly hard working vehicles in today. Come and have a look. Hi, I'm Jensen Jack and I'm the boss. Hi, I'm Mika Mallet. Hi, I'm Lewis Lamp. Hi, I'm Giuseppe Grinder. Hi, I'm Nelson Nutt. And hi. I'm Patsy Pliers. Tools. A good mechanic needs great tools and equipment. Take a look in our toolbox and find out about our favorites. A grinder. Grinders are used to cut metal. Nuts. And then down here we have nuts and bolts. Nuts and bolts are used to hold two or more parts together. A jack. Jacks lift vehicles up so we can look underneath them. Mallets. Mallets knock out dents and vehicles. And here we have a gripper lamp. Gripper lamps cling to the vehicle to light up the area we're working on. And pliers. Pliers can grip parts that are too tiny for fingers. Giant tractor! Big open spaces need monster tractors. The biggest tractors have eight wheels, giving them amazing grip and strength. Here we see a tire. And it says, the huge tires have deep treads that help the tires grip on muddy ground. There's the tread and double wheels. I wonder, can you guys hear the birds in the background? <laughs> Here it says the world's biggest tractor is called Big Bud. Bud is 27 feet long. 14 feet tall and weighs more than 10 elephants. <laughs> lights help the tractor work at night. How many lights can you see? The mirror lets the driver see what's behind him. The mirror is right there. <clears throat> Big rig. A big rig is a mighty truck that has a powerful engine. Engine cap pulling one or two trailers. Big rigs pull anything from tanks to fuel to food supplies. Here's the cab. Some cabs are so big the drivers can sleep in them. Fuel tank. Rigs use lots of fuel so they need big fuel tanks. Here's the horn, and she's saying the big rig's loud horn lets you know it's coming. There's the trailer, and down here it says massive rigs can weigh as much as 40 hippos. The longest two trailer rigs are as long as eight cars parked end to end. Tractors. Tractors are one of the hardest working machines. They are slow, but their big rear wheels give them the super strength they need to pull heavy farm machinery. And here it shows the engine. Small, wheel, small front wheels help tractors to turn around in small spaces. The cab. The cab roof is designed to protect the driver in an accident. Machinery on trailers are attached to the drawbar. And there's the drawbar right there. 
and the wheel. And down here it says the world record for the largest tractor wheelie is 5.3 miles. In Canada, 601 tractors took part in the biggest tractor parade ever. That's so many. Cement truck. This amazing machine mixes up cement and gravel and water to make concrete on its way to the building site. Cement trucks need a crew of two, um, one to drive and one to work the mixer. The massive drum turns one way to mix the concrete and the other pushes it out. A screw-like blade inside the drum helps mix the concrete. The ready-to-use concrete comes out of the chute. And here's the chute right there. And here it says, the mixer's huge drum holds nearly 1.5 tons of mixed concrete. That's like 90,000 bags of candy. That's a lot that would go in there, huh? And tow trucks. A tow truck is your best friend if, you, if your car breaks down. It's a tow truck's job to pull vehicles out of trouble and take them to the nearest garage for repairs. Chains can be attached to the links to drag vehicles safely. And there's the link. The boom lifts vehicles up and out of a ditch. And there's the boom winch. And the hook is attached to the vehicle being rescued. So there's the hook and chain. See? And at the bottom it says, 292 tow trucks formed the world's longest tow truck parade in New York City in 2008. And on the last page, we have the garbage truck. You hear garbage trucks in the street early in the morning, emptying the trash from homes and shops. Stinky, but very important work. This type of garbage truck is called a rear loader. The back of the truck opens and hydraulic um, pistons tip the hoppers up to unload the trash. So here's the hopper and the brush. Here it has the compactor plate. Trash is emptied into the hopper where the compactor plate compresses it to make it as small as possible. And here's the controls. And at the bottom it says the United Kingdom produce, produces more than 100 million tons of trash a year. And here on the last page is just a bunch of different stickers, but you can see different tools one more time, like the jack, the pliers, nuts, um, a wrench, uh, a grinder, and lots of other tools. <laughs> it looks like there was a friend who was putting stickers here and here and here. Can you guys tell what... <clears throat> if these are tractors or trucks or cement mixers, what do you see? All right, friends. Thanks for listening. I miss you guys, and I can't wait to see you soon. Bye.